Hey everybody, it's me, Livy B, and welcome back to my channel. This week's video is Coffee on the Couch with Livy, but as you can see, I am not in my usual setup as per the last two Coffee on the Couches. Obviously, I was on my couch at home, but now that I am in college, it's coffee in the college dorm room. Maybe? I don't know. So anyways, um, yikes. Today I am drinking just a nice chamomile tea. I say nice, I haven't even tried it yet. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of tea. To me it just tastes like subtly flavored hot water. So let's give it a try. I'm sick. I just need something to make me feel better. Yep, tastes like hot water. Lovely. Anywho, let's get into our first topic. So, to start off this month's Coffee on the Couch, uh, if you follow me on my main Instagram, you would see that I got a new tattoo. Yes, I got a sunflower right here. I would show you, but I would have to be in my bra and that video would get flagged. So we're not going to do that. But I will insert some clips of me getting the tattoo and... You're going to be here a while. <laughs> Let me tell you, that was the worst pain I have ever endured in my entire life. I did it all in one sitting. It was about 2 hours and 15 minutes, but oh my gosh. But like, at first I was like, oh, this is painful, but like, I can get through this. It's okay. She said it would only be like an hour and a half. And then by the second hour, I was like, every time she went to go like dip back into the ink, I was just like, are you done? Yeah, no, not yet. And like, you know when you're in so much pain that you feel like you might like actually throw up? That's how I felt. I felt like I was literally going to throw up. That's how painful it was. But through all that pain, it turned out so beautiful and I'm absolutely in love with it. As I said in my Instagram post, sunflowers to me radiate such a positive vibe and it just reminds me to always be happy and sunflowers are always facing towards the sun and to me that represents a sense of optimism and it's just such a meaningful tattoo to me and I wanted it for so long and I was so happy to finally get it and the day that I got the tattoo I actually read an interesting story about the sunflower is actually the Greek symbol for Clyde, a water nymph who died grieving her lover and reincarnated as a sunflower and as a sunflower she was always facing towards the sun hoping that one day her lover Apollo would return out of the sun in his chariot to return to her and they would be reunited. And I thought that was such a cute story. And like, it was so coincidental that I had found that story the day that I was getting that tattoo. So that was like, incredible. I got the tattoo done at Wild World Inc. by Toria, but she goes by Rat. And I will link her Instagram down below as well as the studios. Oh, actually, slowly getting better. So, as I said, I am in college now, so I am still getting used to living in my dorm. I'm contemplating 
doing a room tour for you guys. If you guys want that, thumb this video up or let me know down below in the comments. I live in a literal shoebox, so it'll be a very short video. But yeah, getting used to classes is very... <laughs> it takes time, I guess. Uh, but I love the city I am in. It is amazing, and I love going downtown almost every weekend. It's just amazing. I love the vibe, and I love the aesthetic here. I was actually in one program when I first came here, but I was on the waiting list for another one. And luckily, someone dropped out, and I got to get into the program I actually wanted to go into, which is cosmetic management, which I think is perfect for me, don't you think? Yes, so that is all the updates I have for you guys for this month. Not a whole lot has been going on just because I have been getting settled in my new home for the year and classes and stuff. So, yes. Now moving on to the Q&A portion of this video. So I asked you guys on my Instagram to ask me questions with the hashtag coffee on the couch with Livy or hashtag beauty by Butler and I got three questions so I will be answering those right now. Temptations kill says hashtag coffee on the couch with Livy. What's it like pooping in the same washroom as guys? Well, uh, Lord. <laughs> I honestly don't even know how to answer this question, but um, basically, I don't poop in the co-ed bathroom. I go to the girls' bathroom for that. I have severe poop anxiety, too, so it's been hard to even just poop in a public bathroom. God, this is so weird. Um, but yeah, no, I don't poop with guys in the washroom. I don't know. Uh, Kirsten Ann asks, how much time does it take you to do your everyday makeup routine? And then she also asked, how are you, also, how are you so gorgeous? Girl! Thank you, first of all, like, so are you, girl, like, shush. Um, anyways, so, how much time does it make, take me to do my morning routine. Well, lately I have not been wearing foundation a whole lot just because I get either too lazy or I'm just saving products because I'm a broke ass college student already. But usually it takes me about 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes to get my face done. I always start with my eyebrows, move on to my eyes, and then I do my bronzing, blush, and highlight, and then I'm pretty much done after that. Also, let me know down below if you guys want an everyday makeup routine. I'll do that for you guys as well. But yeah, if I am doing foundation, it might take me about a half hour. My brows are the item of my face that take the longest time because I am so particular with my eyebrows. But yeah, so on a day that I'm doing just concealer as a cover-up, I would say it's about 15 to 20, and if I'm doing foundation, then it's 20 to 30 minutes. And that is all the questions I got from you guys today. <sighs> Actually starting to really like this tea, and it feels really nice going down because I'm so sick. Also, of course, I'm sick and my nose ring gets infected. Anywho, that is all I have for you guys today and for this month's edition of Coffee on the Couch with Livy. And if you guys want to be featured in next month's Coffee on the Couch, you can always ask me questions with the hashtag Coffee on the Couch with Livy or hashtag Beauty by Butler for a chance to be featured. And I will see you guys next week. Bye. <coughs>